Hello everyone, this is Direwolf20, and welcome to episode 11 of Direwolf20's server play series, hanging out on Forgecraft, with Cloud Hunter, Tema, Soren, Slowpoke, and, um, Slowpoke was here, but he disappeared to yeah, speak. Yeah, he'll be back. Okay, cool. And then, uh, also Pahamar and Lexmanos are here. Hey guys. Hello. How goes it, sir? It's going. Yeah? What's new and exciting? One, two, and it's a step. really friggin' cold inside. Well, that's what you get for living in Canada. Yeah, being Canadian. Yeah. Mm. Hold on, I'm, I'm feeling a little hurt. I'm gonna go to the hospital and get my feels checked for free. Okay, good. <laughs> you're, you're gonna want to do that. That was the best Canadian joke I've heard in a long time. <laughs> I've never heard that one, honestly. I... Good jokes. You need to get a little better. <laughs> Does that have to be a normal stick? Arcane workbench. Oh, wait, you know what? It might be just that I don't have any. No, it should be flashing or something. Maybe it has to be a normal stick. Maybe it has to just be normal old wooden stick. Let's go see. Let's speed this up, shall we? So uh, today I'm working a little bit on a couple different things, actually. I want to get the Thumbcraft stuff up and running a little bit, but I also, because I'm obviously like super duper low on wood, want to get more wood going on. So I uh, started to build a planter, which will be uh, integral in getting wood. We're going to have like a little tree farm right outside. But I have a couple ideas on this tree farm thing, and there's uh, I want to try a couple things. I haven't really planned this out too well, but I have an idea or two that I want to try that might be interesting. Let's see if... That. Ah, there we go. Yes, that fixed. Okay, nice. Uh, cool. Well, you can go away then. Uh, then I also wanted to do this. I want to get a bunch of these because, like, they're always kind of useful to have anyway. And I'll just store them in a chest around here somewhere. Yay, that'll do. But I need four of them. Because I want to make a transvector interface. Mm. Soren, how's the base coming along? Good. We're yeah. Working on magic area now. Oh, nice. I'm kind of excited for that. So you're getting kind of like the whole like area cleared out and ready to go for us, and then we'll start building over there pretty soon. Is that the plan? Yep. We're nice. almost ready to start putting things on. Nice. Okay, cool. So we'll start building in that base pretty soon. All right. So I've got my transvector interface. I've got this. I've got this. I've got some of these. And I've got some of these just in case, so I don't think I'll need them. Let's jump into Batmorph because we've got some work to do. You know, I'm going to go ahead and make the case of the fact that Batmorph, while awesome for being able to fly, is even better for being able to fit in a one by one space. Right? Compact it's circuits. Kind of awesome. If I do say so myself. Mm hmm. There we go. So now you should have power. Good. Excellent. Cool. Um, let's go ahead and let you plant and see where you decide to plant things at. So, well, not there, obviously, because I need to get saplings in there. There we go. A nice little 3x3. Three three. Um, I'm thinking we're going to want that to be a little bit larger. So I'm going to want to get the upgrade going in there. Let me get that ready. So I want an upgrade module. Let's go with like the second tier. I don't want it to be too large. Like I could go up in tiers pretty quickly. Um, iron upgrade. So three pieces of iron and a gold nugget and some of that raw plastic. Three, three, a gold nugget, which I might have one over here still. I do. And what else was it? Redstone. Ooh, I might not have redstone here. Soren, could you bring me some redstone to the workshop? Are you in a position to do that? Yeah. Cool. I'm right at the little crafting thingy. Rough estimate? Oh, uh, like, I don't know. I just need two for now, but if you want to bring me a few more just so I have them in case. Sure. Cool. Thanks, buddy. Oh, that's perfect. We really need to either build a sorting system so we can set up a quarry or go mining. Because I think we're really low on some things, aren't we? Yeah, redstone being one of them. Yeah. Alright, so let's bump this guy up in speed. Oh, now we're talking. Look at it go. That's pretty awesome. 
that clear away all my saplings? Yeah, so I think we'd actually get another one, two back. Three back, actually, and three forward. So we, we would, if we have more saplings, have a bunch there. Let's see. Did any saplings drop from what I just cleared out here? Probably. I could even get a few more if I really wanted to. Just to prove that I have the right size area mapped out. Because I need to place down, like, the harvester next, so... I want to make sure to get that appropriately done. Right? You gonna do something? I would have imagined you planting things by now. There we go. Okay, cool. So we're in good shape. Just want to make sure it's not going to do much more. Cool. That should be enough. So what are you up to, Mr. Tema? I am currently mining Ooh. redstone. Oh, sounds fun. And I've, I'm trying something different. I'm using a silk touch pickaxe. Yes. As my primary yes. axe. As your primary? It's actually working. Yeah. And it's working out quite well, to be honest. I've got a lot of this stuff like redstone um, and, you know, lapis doesn't sort of fill up my inventory very quickly. Neat. Oh yeah, I guess I, I could see that making sense. But then you can't yes. have it being so you can't have it being fortuned, but I guess you could go, you know, process it or something, right? Yeah, so yep. do that later. Right. Yeah, do that later. It's kinda neat. Alright, so we're going to need another three of these and another three of these. So and another one of these. So the uh, harvester here can harvest the wood in that same, you know, kind of area. There we go. Uh, that all looks cool. So now we will get stuff, but we want to send the item somewhere. So what I'd like to do is see if I can get the transvector interface to hook up in like kind of a cleanish type area. So would here be a good spot for it? Let's see, one, two, three, four, five. That's a little too close. I don't know if this will work, but we can try it right here. Can I hook up you? Find and complete, okay, good. So what I should be able to do then is get impulse item ducks set up that will kind of go along down here. Three, four, I guess. Um, you know what I should probably wind up doing is... Because I don't think I can pump into the bottom of barrels. You have to rotate it. Yeah, I could rotate it, but then they would have the pictures upside down. That would be right. unacceptable. <laughs> so I'm just going to do that. Channel. It'll look a little better anyway that way. Oh, Mr. Hey, Slowpoke. Slowpoke. I'm good How to meet you, man. I'm good. Yep, I'm recording, by the way. Okay. Cool. So let me get a couple barrels, guys. I need to uh, make sure I have enough wood for that. And then we'll be back. Okay, guys, we are back. And, wow, these trees are growing quickly. So better get some stuff set up to put them in. Uh, one, that'll be for wood, saplings, and apples. So we want to get rid of this connector here. We want to set this guy to pull out, and we're going to install a pneumatic servo like so here. Well, you know what? Actually, yeah, we, wow, that's a derp. I'm so dumb sometimes. It's hilarious. Okay. Hey, it's just a fact. I'm, I'm just saying okay. I don't know. Hmm? There we go. Uh, Alright, so we're going to um, extract everything from here. We're just going to say ignore redstone, pull everything out. <laughs> this thing will filter to these things, whitelist, cool. And this can filter whitelist wood. You will whitelist saplings. And um. you will whitelist apples. 
So if then... the game sounds up for you. Okay. I will go get his stuff. Ta-da! Actually, I'm wondering if this power would work here. I'm gonna try that real quick. Maybe that energy works. That's kind of cool. We'll see once it finishes planting things if it's actually working or not. Because what'll happen is it'll drain energy. Wow, Transvector Interface is working with uh, TE power. That's cool. Yeah, that's it. It's good. What's that? It doesn't work from generator to something or another, but it does work cell to cell. Nice. Now that's working really well, actually. I like nice. it. Um, so we have sludge, but that's okay. I'm not going to worry about sludge. I've played around with sludge before, and I don't know. I don't see that much use for it. At least not right now. So, uh, hey, guess what we have at the workshop, guys? We have uh, a lot of wood. And we're working on saplings. Nice. I'm just, uh, you know, obviously sending all the saplings first and foremost go into the planter to get replanted. But, you know, we'll start collecting saplings once that's done. Cool. Um, I guess the one thing I should do just to save everyone the hassle would be make a sound muffler. Nobody wants to hear it because it's right outside the workshop because I didn't want yeah. to. Um, yeah. Uh, you know what's funny about the sound muffler? It requires a piece of redstone, which I don't have. Uh, give me a second. Okay. If you insist. <laughs> Thanks, buddy. Mm -hmm. See? Even more. Soren, you're so helpful. Indeed. Wow. That, that is loud. Right? But hold on. Hold everything. Hold them. Uh, this is the center block, right? Yeah. Let's see if that helps. Better? What? What? It's better, right? Yes. <laughs> Good. Oh, look, we got our first apple. Nice. All right. So, tree farm complete. Ready to go. Nice. Yeah, and no shattering people's ears. Also useful. Indeed. We need redstone. We need I like that. Several things. Uh, all right, all your stuff is in that chest, or a chest upstairs, but you start. Oh dear. But I got oh. your stuff. What did you do? Okay. Die, Slowpoke? I did. Ah, uh, you're a noob. I am. Um, well, I kind of went sound. AFK. Yeah. At least your house is nearby. Oh, did you hear what happened to di to Tar Diet? I did not. Oh, it was the funniest thing ever. Yeah. Like, Go on. Like. <laughs> Seriously, the funniest thing. So, I was in your house. Right. Uh, and my oh. stream told me to troll you. Troll me? <laughs> yeah. I can't imagine anyone on your stream recommending that I get trolled. That doesn't even sound like a plausible scenario. The entire stream recommended that you get trolled. The entire really? stream? That, you don't that say. That sound like it should happen. The entire stream. Why is your door blocked off? Whose door? Uh, uh, your old door to your old house. I don't know, maybe he's on. Weren't you just saying you were trolling him? Okay, so 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 here's the thing. Yeah, we. Right. So what I did is literally, you know, where you spawn in from the book. Right. I I just surrounded that with stone, but then I just got the builder's wand and just used it everywhere in the house. So I didn't break any block. I just right. filled every every space with a block of stones. Went up. So. Yeah. And the idea was, is you would just 
zone in to pitch black and go blah blah. And t- ten seconds later, you figure it out and oh, everything will be good again. Okay. So I did that and and left. And then maybe a few hours later, I I'm not quite sure when it was. I just I was sitting down watching the movie. And on my screen, I just saw this message from Tar going, Slow, I hate you. Like, it was really hilarious. vicious and venomous. So what had happened was... <laughs> Targ <laughs> was in his house. Right. And a creeper came along and blew him up. And you know what Targ's like? If he hears a creeper, he just stands there and lets the creeper blow him up. and Because yeah. he can't cope with it. Right. So he did that, he let the Cooper blow him up, but it took out his bed and it took out all of his machines and everything. Oh boy. So he went back to spawn. Right. And he figured the fastest way back to his house was through your house. Oh. <laughs> so he went to your house and obviously couldn't get to the book because it was all blocked off with stone. <laughs> so he then had to make his own way back to his own house. And he's obviously been in his chunk long enough for everything to despawn. So, like, all oh. of his machines, all of his chests and everything, his gear, all gone. Really? Yeah. yeah. So, wow. He didn't kill you, he killed Tog. He was mad as hell. I can believe it. It was so funny. Oh, <laughs> poor guy. I back away. Oh, no, don't get me wrong. I mean, Tog's used to this now. I mean... He loses his gear more than anybody because he does just sort of stand there and let He does a lot. Yeah, he does die a lot. And I helped him get back on his feet. He came back to came over to my place and picked up some resources and stuff like that. Um, Right, gotcha. But it was just hilarious. (laughs) That's the poor dog. So funny. Like, literally, the. The viciousness in his voice when he said he hated me. Like, he's the last person you'd expect that from. My favorite part was, so I was like, what'd I do? <laughs> nice. I'm like, what do you mean, what'd you do? <laughs> That's terrible. All right, YouTube audience, now that you got to hear that story, I'm going to go uh, do what I was going to do off camera, which is uh, collect some resources so that I can get a uh, decanting golem. And hopefully he will behave himself and live forever in the workshop and not die randomly. We'll see. We will totally see. All right, back in just a few minutes, guys. Um, All right, guys, we're back, and I'm making a decanting golem, I think. We're going to find out if I've got everything I really need or not. Uh, So this guy needs to be filled up with water, and we need, in order to get this, uh, first off, I need the canting, and then I need to upgrade it to alchemy. The canting is five water and five vacuous. So, five water and five vacuous. Well, I can get four vacuous from the chest. I can get four water and one vacuous from a water bucket. And then I can get one more water from sugarcane. And then this goes in. Hooray! Column animation core. Cool. All right, you go there. Uh, Next up, I'm going to need... 15 water, 15 modus, 15 percantio. That shouldn't be a problem. So, great wood logs. And we're also going to want some of you. We're going to want a lot more of you. Luckily, I've got wood outside. You're not fooling me, Soren. Nope. You might fool Slowpoke with that disguise, but not me. Soren, come and let me in. I'm at your back door. I can't break through. You have a back door? I, I, hold on, maybe I don't. I think so, yeah. There's like a brick wall at the back here. Oh, okay, so... I'm nailed. at positive 1181. Positive yeah, I think I know where you are. <laughs> Alright, guys, I'm there. going to take care of all this stuff, and then I'll be back. Start doing things, would you, mister? There you go. Actually, guys, I wanted to stop by Tema's base real quick, because I wanted some Elementum. And he's got... Oh, you've got... You don't have that much of this stuff. Um, no, I don't. I started um, uh, uh, basically voiding it in a, um, a heated redstone generator. Oh. I've turned that off for the moment because I want to build up a little bit of a surplus first. Neat. 
Uh, guys, remember, Elementum will increase the speed at which you um, break down the stuff in these things. So, yeah, we're all about doing that. Um, it'll definitely be worthwhile to do. So when you have Elementum in here, this bar drops faster, basically. So why don't I get myself a few jars here. Nice base, Tamer. Thank you. I like that a lot. <laughs> is there a, 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 an actual method for getting up these? Or is it just fly? Uh, no, just fly. That, that's the method. You need there we go. elevator blocks. See how much faster yeah, the purple I'll side's dropping now? There. I mean, it's cool. Like, everybody can fly. You've all got fat <laughs> mode. <laughs> yeah. I'll put something in. Batman. All right, back in a minute when I'm done with this stuff. All right, guys, I think I'm ready to get this guy going. Let's do three water bottles and an empty water jar. Ha. And the water jar, and that should be doable. I need an ender pouch pretty badly. Yep. Right, did Lemming announce he was retiring as well, did he? What's that? Did Lemming announce he was retiring as well, did he? I don't think so. Also recording still. Uh, I think he, yes, did. he did. He did? Okay. So you're cool with that being on the video? Well, if it's announced, it's announced. He publicly announced on Twitter. Okay. Yeah, not that surprising. He's been quite he busy. very busy. It's hard, the amount of work that you guys put into your mods, it's really hard to keep up with when real life gets busy. It's totally understandable. Ah, oh, there you go. Good job, little buddy. 22. Oh, you're just healing yourself. Okay, uh, I just need to get... That nifty wand thingy now, the bell. Soren, have a Gollumancer's bell handy? <laughs> I do. Uh, I figured you would. If you go to our house. I was actually kind of just digging around in the workshop to see if we have any nether quartz, but I guess not. There should be in the house. Nether quartz? Okay. We have 34 cool. nether quartz and a Gollumancer's bell. Ooh. Yeah, the other nice thing about the silk touch pickaxe is you get a lot of cinnabar. Alright, it is an arcane work table recipe. Mm hmm. I know I should never let Soren do that Thomcraft research. Now he has a bell. I was gonna get one way or another. I know you were. <laughs> it has to happen. It's pretty much required. Yeah. Just go around there. Here we go. Back. Cool. I should be able to also do this. So that should connect to all those things. And now we're in good shape. Look at that. What's even better is if That's I cool. do this. Let's see. I should, should eventually turn those into void jars, but we'll get there eventually. Eventually, we'll make them void jars. Have you tested the void jars with the golems? Do golems still like void things, Tem uh, Tema? Um, I haven't, but uh, yes, I think they should. Okay, cool. Because I know, like, if you around. pipe it in, it'll work. But I've never actually tested the void jars with the golems. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it should work, just from the way they've been um, sort of programmed in the API. Cool. Okay, good. All right, guys, we'll be back in a moment. And for my next trick, I want to make my favorite boots, because I hate how slow I walk. <laughs> you don't understand, Soren. Like, I always feel, I've never, I don't think I've ever said this on camera, but I always feel like when I'm running around in the world, like, I have this urge to, like, keep the video interesting and keep it moving, right? So, like, I hate moving really slowly without any rapid speed stuff on, because I always kind of feel like it's boring watching me walk from place to place. So that's why I try and mm -hmm. get, like rapid speed items to make me run faster that much, you know, earlier in the game. Right. So I try and do my best to get something that helps me move quicker. 
Just so it's like, all right, now I'm going over here, and it doesn't take me, like, 30 seconds to walk across the room, you know what I mean? Yep. You know, kind of, sort of, something like that. All right, now I'm going to have fun with my enchanting room, because I get to pick and choose my enchants. Haha. -ha. Um, do I have haste in here anywhere? I should really, like, do this better. Ah, uh, haste two. I've got one of them. Knockback, looting, protection, repair. I do have a single haste two. Now, do I have a haste two in the originals chest? I yes. should. Okay, so what I'm going to do is combine them, and then I'll pull off the haste three, and then put the haste three book in here. That sound like a good plan? Yeah. So haste two, and haste two should get me haste three, and then I can pull it off, get the book for haste three, copy it, and then go from there. Oh, and several people have posted comments that they can't right-click this block and get it. I think it's only in the newer version of Open Blocks, so you'll have to update, um, you know, whatever mod pack or whatever you're using uh, in order to get that ability. There we go, 40. And you're struggling to keep up with the energy demands, aren't you? That's okay. We'll have to do something about that. I think we're gonna need more energy down there, Soren. At some point. Uh, now, how about repair? Unbreaking, smite, sharpness. I should have repair around here somewhere. Oh, there's five copies of repair, too. That's cool. I'll just grab one. Yeah, I um, enchanted uh, the um, uh, thormium scoops. Oh, nice. That's cool. Do they, like, always get repair? I think meteor lands. Um, well, thormium scoops can... And thormium grafters can only take unbreaking and repair. Aha. Uh -huh. So you're pretty much guaranteed to get it. I see. One thing that I have to talk to uh, New Chaz about is it's so hard to place the ink on the right slot and the other thingy in the right slot. You know what I mean? Yeah. Uh, that's not what I meant to do. You weren't supposed to go on the auto enchanting table. I'm a derp. I haven't got projectile Oops. protection and unbreaking three. Neither of those sound like things I would want. All right, you're gonna get repaired, and then I'm gonna rip these enchants off and put the proper ones on. I wouldn't mind protection. What is what's the best protection for? Uh, haste three goes into the originals chest. Uh, unstable, unbreaking, smite, sharpness. Protection three. Do I have a protection four in here, maybe? Treasure and knockback. Da, 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 da. Protection four. That'll do. And I'm just going to go ahead and guess that it's 40 levels. All right, guys, I'll be back in a minute when I'm ready to do all this cool stuff. All right, let's do this properly this time, shall we? Boots of the Traveler, I wanna get haste on there first, that's my priority. Then I'm gonna throw repair on, and if I can, I'll get protection four. Nice. That is what I'm talking about. Four is the best, right? I assume so. Cool. And just to be quick about it, I'm gonna repair these, because it'll repair in here a lot faster than they will repair you know, on my person. And then I'm gonna replace my mage boots here with these kind of hate breaking up the set. It's nice having the whole set of mage gear, but on the other hand, I get to run really fast. So there's that. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. So it looks like um, I'm pretty sure we've pretty much hit the wrapping up point for the episode. So got a lot done. Got a whole infusion enchanting set up here, or a whole infusion um, crafting mechanic going here for uh, Thaumcraft. My golem has, it seems like no problem hitting all three rows here, especially because I added this little setup. So that's cool. I think I might even just be like really cool about it. Put that there so he doesn't have any problem walking around and hitting that side of things. Hopefully he'll be able to path over there. We'll see if we run into any pathing problems with him. There we go, and I've got fast running boots. Hooray! Oh, that's so much better. You don't know how much better that feels. Like, I've been using bat form mostly just to be able to run faster. That's what I've been using bat form more right. so than for anything else. Uh, we also have a nice silent wood farm over here, so we've got plenty of wood. Uh, saplings should be showing up soon. I'm actually kind of interested to see how we are by way of saplings. 
I might even go ahead and block off. Yeah, that's plenty of saplings in there. How about you guys do that? And then we don't have to worry about any more saplings showing up. Cool. Any more saplings that get created should start piling into here. And then in the future, we can use them for all kinds of nefarious purposes. For now, Darwell20 signing off. Hope you guys enjoyed the episode. Uh, next episode, Soren, should we start working on our base, you think? Yeah. Well, I mean, you've been working on it. What I mean is I'll start working on it with you and actually putting cool stuff in it. And we'll show you guys the work Soren's put into it next episode. All right, guys. Take it easy.